Welcome to UniArch Learning Hub. In this episode, we are going to talk about camera management. We will demonstrate how to add and manage IPCs in UniArch NVR. Let's get started. At the first time login, you will be asked to log into the system with the default username and password. Then the system will ask you to set a strong password or draw an unlock pattern for security. Now we have logged into the system and this is the live window. To add cameras on NVR, right click the mouse and go to camera. On this page, you will find that this NVR supports 8 channels and all of them support PoE function. In the following steps, we will take this PoE NVR as an example to walk you through the process of adding IPCs. There are four methods of adding cameras on NVR. The first one is plug and play. This method requires the camera to support PoE function and the camera must be directly plugged into the NVR channel port. If the camera uses the default password or it has been added to the channel before, the camera will go online automatically once it is connected to the NVR. If the password has already been changed, you can enter the new password to make it online. The second way is adding by IP address. Select the channel first, then click on Edit Device. All the devices in the same network with NVR are listed here. Select the camera that you are going to add. If you are going to add a third-party camera, it's recommended to set the protocol to OnBIF. Or custom a protocol if the third-party device supports RTSP. The device we are going to add is a UniArch IPC, so any of the three protocols will work. We will go with the private protocol. Then input the username and password below. Enable extended transmission if a long-distance transmission is in use. Click OK, then the camera will be added. You can then see the status turn blue, which means the IPC is added successfully. The blue icon enables you to view the live view of the IPC in the preview window. Other information including camera name, its status, IP address, model, the protocol through which the camera is added, the vendor of the camera, and port number are also displayed here. The third method is to add a device via MyDDNS, which requires you set up a valid server address and domain name on IPC's web page. Then fill in these info below. The device will be added then. The last one is adding by domain name. Input the valid domain name, port number, and user info. Click OK, then the camera will be added. To find the cameras in the same network with the NVR, you can click Quick Search in the bottom or set a IP address segment to narrow the search range. Then all the discovered devices will be listed here. By clicking this icon, you can modify the IP address and the default gateway of this added camera. The Edit Device button allows you to modify the info of the added camera like Add Mode, Protocol, Password, etc. To delete or make any added camera offline on PoENVR, you may modify the IP address or password on this page. Then the status of this camera turns gray, place your mouse pointer on it to check the offline reason. That's all for today's learning. Hope this will be helpful to you. Thanks for your watching. See you next time.